What's going on, you beautiful people? Eric Ellis Jr. here with EricEllisJr.com, and in this video, we're going to cover how to promote ClickBank products in seven easy steps. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and actually step behind my laptop, and I'm going to go ahead and show you seven actionable steps that you guys can actually use starting today to start generating commissions with ClickBank. Now before we do so, make sure you smash that subscribe button and hit the notifications bell to get notified because right now I'm currently uh, uploading videos on the daily. So do that right now and um, make sure to follow your boy on Instagram at Eric Ellis Jr. Now um, let's get right to it. Uh, the first step, so step number one, is to create a, a clickbank account so the first thing that you guys going to do is literally press login and or not login rather apologize first thing you guys are going to uh, do is press create account and when you guys press create account it's literally just going to tell you to put in your personal information banking information to make sure you get paid and then account information once you guys put in this information, you're simply going to press next step, next step, ne next step, and then your account is going to be created. Now, the second step, step number two, you want to go ahead and find a good offer to promote. So the way we do this is you would simply go to the uh, marketplace once you're actually inside the ClickBank back office. And the way you're going to do that is simply just press uh, marketplace, and then you're going to go and look at the different categories that you guys um, can find to actually promote offers, right? Now, what you're gonna do, uh, the best way, first and foremost, the, the top two, I would say is make money online, and number two is health and wellness. So what I'll do is, if you go to health and wellness, click health and fitness, right? The first thing that you automatically wanna do is you wanna go ahead and filter these uh, offers by the gravity score. What the gravity score simply is, is how many people have actually generated a commission within a week's time frame. So if people are generating sales, then that means it's going to be um, more easy to promote and it's gonna be something that actually converts as an offer. So what you wanna do is simply go to filters and then what you can do is actually filter by gravity. And what you can do is literally, if you notice here, um, gravity 187, so 187 people have gotten a sell with this in the last week. So that means that this offer is actually converting. So what we're gonna do is the next step um, is once you find an offer is to press promote, right? And step number three, right, is to actually make the link smaller. What do I mean, right? Now, First and foremost, before we do step number three, it says 75% um, for each sale, right? So yeah. tracking idea, I'd say YouTube, and you'll understand in a second. What's gonna happen is uh, they're gonna give you this long, ugly, unattractive link, right? So what we're gonna do, step number three, is actually make that link shorter and also make it easier to promote, right? And the way that we're gonna do that is simply by going to Bitly. If you haven't created an account, go to bitly.com. And then what you're gonna be able to do is literally press create and put the link in. And then what we're gonna do is press promote. Now, before we actually grab that link, um, first, one thing that I didn't mention is you wanna see what the actual sales page looks like before you actually decide to promote that offer. And the reason why that's important is because you don't want something spammy, you don't want something unattractive, you don't want to promote something that isn't going to be good, um, that you don't want to tie your brand to, right? So, this looks pretty good, right? The next step would simply be finding a, um, or grabbing the link, so I grabbed the link already, and then what we do is we put it in bit, Bitly, right? So we're making the link shorter. So, what I'm going to do is, lose weight extremely fast 
Now believe it or not, when you guys make the link shorter, what you can also do is write something at the end of that link to make it more attractive. They actually convert more and they get a higher click-through rate. What that means is when people see it, they're more likely to click it if it's not just some random numbers and letters behind, but it's an actual word, right? So right here we put lose weight extremely fast. Then we're gonna go ahead and press save. Now we have our customized link, right? Now the next step is, step number four, is find a YouTube influencer, right? And the way we do that, so depending on what your offer is, you wanna go ahead and find a common problem, right, that that person is trying to solve. So if you're promoting a make money online opportunity, what is their problem? They're trying to make money, they might be broke. If you're promoting a health and wellness or fitness offer, then what is the problem that they're having? A problem that they're having is they're trying to lose weight. So what are some of the things, if we were to go to youtube.com, what are some of the things that these type of individuals would actually be looking, searching for, right? So if I'm trying to lose weight, one thing that I'm gonna do is how to lose weight, right? So how to lose weight. We'll put how to lose weight fast, right? So what we're gonna do is there's gonna be a series of videos that actually show up once you actually search for these results. And what you wanna do is simply just search through the videos and once we scroll down, right, which are, there's two key components for this, this fourth step, right? To find a YouTube influencer, number one, you wanna find a video that has been dropped recently. I would say make sure that the video is actually below six months old. The reason why is because what happens is, if let's just say it's a three year old video, it might not be producing as much traction Currently, it might have just uh, created a lot of traction when it first started. So when you find a video that has uh, has been uh, less than six months, then it's, it's new, it's fresh, and it's probably getting fresh traffic, right? Number two, um, one thing I'd highly recommend is reaching out to YouTube influencers who have a large video view count but don't have a big following because the bigger they're following, the more people are trying to capture their attention, reach out to them, email them, message them on Instagram and so on, right? So what we're gonna do once we actually find a video, um, I'm looking at this one, how to lose uh, weight fast for teenagers. And this one is 635,000 views in the last two months. So two months and we have 635,000 views. So this is the perfect video. We're gonna click it, right? Now the next step is once you find um, the, the YouTube influencer, right? Step number five is to contact the influencer for um, paid partnerships. So you're simply just gonna go to reach out to them and simply just and do a business inquiry for paid partnerships, right? So the way that we do that is they usually have their contact information in their description. So if you look here, right, we're gonna scroll down, show more, and we're actually gonna go ahead and look um, for their information. So, it says, if you look right here, it says business inquiries only, and then we have the email. Now there's two ways that you guys can actually contact these influencers. Number one, I would recommend is um, Gmail. That's always the most professional, that's always business, right? However, if they don't have their um, email account, the next step that you guys can do is simply go ahead, they usually have their social media handles in their description, and you could reach out to them on Instagram via Instagram inbox, right? So what we're gonna do, simply go to your email provider, compose, business inquiries, right? Subject line, you always, So what I'm gonna do is you always wanna go ahead and put it as business inquiry, and then you wanna go ahead and let them know which social media platform it's on. So business inquiry, YouTube. And then you simply wanna mention, right, the title of their video. And one thing that I'd highly recommend is complimenting them on their video and act as if you've actually watched the content. Me personally, I didn't watch the content on this, but I'm just showing you guys an example, right? and always address the individual that you're reaching out to and make it personalized by uh, mentioning their name, right? So, hey, Nicole. I recently stumbled 
across your video. Video. Oh gosh. So that was the actual link. What did it say? How to lose weight fast for teenagers. Actually, this is what I'll do. I can simply just go ahead and um, add the actual link. Your video, and then parentheses, how to lose weight fast for teenagers. Then I'm gonna put, I loved the content. I currently run a fitness vlog and wanted to know if I could pay you to put the link to my blog in the description of this that video. Hope to hear from you soon. Best Eric. So guys, it's that simple. What you want to do is you want to go ahead and reach out to them. And once you reach out to them, you're simply going to go ahead and let them know, hey, how's it going? I saw your video and then you just leave the link of the video and you're going to say, I, I enjoy the content. I like the content. Um, I, and you always want to put, because you don't want to say I'm sending this person to my, uh, my sales offer or something of that nature. You don't want this person to think that you're trying to make money off of them, right? You simply say you're, if, you, if it's make money online, my make money online blog, if it's whatever the category is, my blah, 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 blog, right? You're simply just trying to provide value. And what you say is run a blog and wanted to increase the traffic to my blog. and see if I could pay you to put the link to my blog in the description of your YouTube video, right? Then what's gonna happen is, law of average guys, you're not gonna get the first person to actually respond. So whether you reach out to them via Instagram or on YouTube, right, you're simply gonna go and reach out to people, reach out to people, reach out to people, reach out to people, and eventually people are going to actually respond. And then once they respond, you simply go ahead and let them know how much you're willing to pay them. Now let's just say you, you uh, pay somebody $20, right? Now I want you guys to look at this really quick. This person um, uploaded this video two months ago and it's currently at 655,000 views. So within the last two months, within the last two months, it has on average about 300,000 views per month. So with that being said, literally, even if 1% decided to actually click on your offer, 1% of 300,000 is 3,000 people. So that's 3,000 clicks. I'm pretty sure you'd get at least one sell, which would have you in profit, and any additional sales after that is complete profit, right? So with that being said, the power of leveraging YouTube influencers is freaking incredible, right? Now, um, once you reach out to them and they actually decide to um, hop on board, right? Step number six, simply go ahead and send them the promotional materials, meaning your bit.ly link that you created earlier, you're simply gonna go ahead and send them that link. And then step number seven, guys, is the easiest step of all, is wait for the commissions to roll in. Once they roll in, you simply rinse and repeat. Now, um, literally, you rinse and repeat the seven steps. You just go ahead, reach out to more influencers, Pay them more money, get more traffic, get more sales, rinse and repeat. And that, my friend, is the seven easy steps 
to promoting ClickBank offers. Now again, as stated before, if first and foremost, if you guys enjoy this actual video, make sure to actually drop a um, like, drop a thumbs up, right? And subscribe, hit the notifications uh, bell, so that way you guys can get more valuable future content. Now when it comes to affiliate marketing, um, if you guys are kind of brand new to this, I do have an ebook for you guys. You can go to affiliatesplaybook.com or you can hit the link in the description and grab access to Affiliates Playbook. And um, it'll be a very quick read. And also if you guys want the exact strategies, not just this one, but a ridiculous amount of strategies that I use. Um, and, and, and if you have no idea about uh, affiliate marketing you guys want the step-by-step -step process I do have a course called jumpstart affiliate where you guys can literally get hands-on mentorship by me and number two um, it'll give you guys over 40 hours of video content teach you guys how to really generate a ridiculous amount of income with affiliate marketing promoting Clickbank offers JVZoo any type of offers um, you guys can go to jumpstartaffiliate.com or link in the description and last but not least guys uh, all the tools and resources to create sales funnels, uh, to do email marketing, to generate traffic, all that stuff will be in the link in the description. I'll give you access to all my tools and resources, and um, you guys can go to ericellisjr.com to get those as well. Whatever works best for you guys. But again, I appreciate you guys so freaking much. As always, hit that subscribe subscribe button. Eric Ellis Jr. Checking out.